What's good, YouTube? Y'all starting to know who it is. The all-knowing, all-loving, all-powerful, sexy as hell host, Lamont Tyson. And my transformation led me to a new Life Gains candidate who has started with me. And my man's name is Raheem, and he is right here. When I first got him two weeks ago, he was 398. Now I got him down to 381, and we're going to see how I work out with him. So we start my man out with three sets of leg extensions for 12 reps, getting his knees warmed up, getting his body warm, prepared for the work that we're going to do. And I always find it an honor when someone looks at the kind of thing that I've done and reshape my body, reshape my mentality, and reshape my health for the better. And that's what Raheem has done. He's got the eye of the tiger look in his eye, and he's starting this workout out a little nonchalant. We getting him warmed up, and then we immediately jump into having him push that sled. Ladies and gentlemen, when you're working out with a client that's got a little bit of weight to lose, one of the best things you can do is use their own body weight to help them lose weight. And so as I'm starting to get him a little strong, I'm starting to get his endurance up, I do a couple of exercises using his legs where he's having to use his own body weight and move objects in an effort to burn as many calories as I possibly can. And boy, he was working today. I had him push this sled about three or four times there and back. How you feeling? It's tight. Now you know you went down there faster this time than what you did the last time, right? <laughs> You know you need. You know you gotta have some weight in your life. You gotta have some weight in your life. So I'm gonna give you some weight. What a difference two weeks made. Two weeks ago, my man couldn't even make it all the way down there one time. Now he's got a 45 pound plate on this sled, and he's turning those legs, ladies and gentlemen. This is progress for him. Progress for you may not be what he's doing. But every single time you come to the gym, you keep working at it, you stay motivated, and you make gains on your own, and it'll come. So after he did the sled, and I've got him warmed up, I got him sweating, I'm having him do his own body weight lunges. And, you know, for someone who's of average size or someone who's an average gym person, you know, a lunge might not be that difficult. It was a little difficult for my man because he's not used to doing them. He's having to learn how to not only stabilize his core, but balance his body. And that can be tough if you're carrying a lot of body weight. But you know what? My man looked at me and he said, you know, you, you tell me to do it, Lamont, I'm going to do it. I'm motivated and I want this. And look at him. That's what he's doing. He wants it and he's going to get it. And he's lost some weight. He's motivated with his diet. But the most important thing, ladies and gentlemen, is he's motivated for his health. You know, uh, he feels like he's sexy as hell already with the bald head, milk dud thing going. He don't got to look no better. But he's got some family members he's concerned with. He wants to be around as long as possible to serve them. He's got some things he want to do in his own life. And he's got some health markers he wants to meet. And so that's what's driving him. That's what's pushing him. That's what's making him go through the process of putting on muscle, getting a better diet, staying consistent with his cardio, and when I tell him to go through hell on these workouts, he goes through it, ladies and gentlemen. Look at him getting in there. Every now and then, he gets a little frustrated because he feels like he should be making gains quicker. But I told him, you know, the essence of this whole entire thing is that it's a lifestyle. It's not that you do something for six months and you're done. This is a complete lifestyle. And he's getting it in, ladies and gentlemen. I'm proud of him. Next thing we do, our major compound movements. I didn't have him do a lot of isolation today, but I threw him right on the bench press. So as he got done burning up those legs, we put him on the bench. I had him do this for four sets of 15 reps. And it's not a lot of weight, but for someone who's just getting themselves in the gym, you figure out what their tolerance is and you push them to that point. And this was it for him. A lot of action burning here. Next thing I had him do, a little bit of rolls for his back. Um, I also had him do a modified pull-up, and that was a little bit too difficult for him. So we got over here, and we added a little bit of weight to this a couple of times to make it intense for him. And I had him do four sets of 12 with this. And 
he wants it. He was getting it in. He was breathing properly. And, you know, he let me know that he's working for me as long as I'm going to work for him. All right. The last thing I had him do on this day was shoulder presses. And on this one, I had him do four sets of 15 shoulder presses. And he hates this exercise. But it's a great compound movement for him. Really, really worked him out today. And guys, it didn't take long to work him out. I mean, we hit this intense workout within a 30 minute period. And I really wanted to go as hard as I could to get the most calories out of him. And we had him do some cardio at the very end in which he's gonna just tell us how he's feeling. So, how you feel now at the end of the workout? Feels good, my shoulders are burning. Yeah. Hey man, I'm proud of you, you're doing good. Huh? You're doing good, I'm proud of you. Let the people know, you sticking with this right, you consistent. Felt burning and felt intense. Intense. Very intense. So now, I got my man walking at the end of his workout. 20 minutes, that's all we need. Don't forget to like my video, comment and subscribe, go get yourself a life game. Follow my man Raheem as he makes this body transformation. And we'll see you on that next video.